HPA Nation, Coach Drew here. Um, here are your latest COVID-19 updates for the gym. We are uh, still in our, I guess, phase two protocol for the gym. Uh, we have not been released yet to have more people in the gym than there currently are. Uh, and I don't feel like that's going to change coming up in the next little bit. So um, we are going to add some stuff back. We'll kind of get to that in a second. Um, we are still in this 10 people per session capacity for the gym um, for the next at least two weeks, uh, two week block here. But we're going to start to call the equipment back in. Uh, we would like for all the equipment to be back by June 15th. Um, if you feel uneasy about coming back to the gym as in any capacity as far as a health and safety standpoint goes, um, reach out to your primary coach, have a conversation with them, or reach out to me directly, and let's have a conversation um, before we get rocking and rolling here. Um, so June 15th is kind of the date we want most of the equipment back in so we can start to program and start to get the, the gym uh, rolling again. All right. Monday, Wednesday, Friday in the gym will continue uh, as, we, as we move forward. We would like to see everybody or all these class times filled up um, this week and next week. So everybody, everybody show up to 6 a.m., 9 a.m., uh, 5.30, and 7 in the, the live classes. When we get to that point, we will add additional classes to it. To help with that, you are no longer uh, restricted to just one class per week. You can sign up for three classes um, ahead of time. We still want you to reserve the class so we know who's going to be there. Uh, but if you reserve a class, you are saying that you're going to be in the gym. I understand that you might take somebody else's spot away if you don't show up after signing up. So I would caution you guys for signing up for the whole week. I would um, maybe sign up for two classes and see how your third class goes uh, throughout the week and, and go from there. Tuesdays and Thursdays are still going to be uh, personal training focused and some small group stuff. The, the goal for this, guys, and what we've seen in, as we've started to have more live classes back is that uh, everybody needs a little bit of extra help. You are not where you were as far as fitness and skill and capacity goes. So what we're gonna try to do over the course of the next couple of weeks is incorporate Tuesdays and Thursdays as some small group personal training and really individualize it for people, all right? Um, this is not happening this week, not happening next week. We're still gonna try to uh, get private sessions in with folks that need some one-on-one -on -one help. That's our priority for Tuesdays and Thursdays, but Saturdays are back, all right? So we'll have Saturdays back starting now. That 7.30 class meets on Saturday, 9 o'clock class meets on Saturday. We'll have a, a specialty 10.15 for the Olympic lifting um, folks that meets on Saturday as well. Um, and then if there is interest, and I will talk to James uh, about potential open gym back up on Saturday as well. But for right now, 7.30 and 9 o'clock are legitimately back on. All right, the Zoom classes are not changing. That's still exactly what it is. That's Monday through Friday, or yeah, Monday through Friday, the regular times for Zoom are still gonna be there. All right, um, gosh, I wanted to say something else about our, bah, 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 bah. oh, I think that was it. Okay, good. Um, just so you guys know, our, um, our safety protocols are constantly being updated and constantly being uh, evaluated by us and making sure that we're doing everything we possibly can to make this environment as clean and as sanitized as possible. One of the extra steps we're going to is now we have a, um, a new sprayer coming in that we're going to spray the entire gym down uh, two times per day, uh, kind of after that morning session is over and then obviously at the end of the day too. Uh, and this will be a complete uh, sanitization of the whole gym. It is a, um, it's a very environment-friendly chemical that we're going to use. It's like a thyme oil-based chemical, but it's also hydrogen peroxide. So it kills everything we have um, as far as bacteria and virus goes in the gym on the surfaces that most people touch. So it's just a, a quick spray over everything, 
let it sit, let it dry, and then it's good to go. Uh, and that's going to be here the, at the start of June, so this week coming up. In addition, you guys have been asking about um, our, our kids' classes and things like that. As the uh, restrictions on COVID-19 get loosened by the government, then we will uh, entertain some younger kids, but we're going to start to bring the high school kids back first. So high school kids that are training are going to come back in first. They're going to do uh, some more private style sessions and we'll go from there. Um, we will make an announcement on the exact date. We're looking at like mid-June to bring them back in a very, very controlled setting. So it won't be by a, an adult class time. It'll be kind of its own thing as we move forward. So that there's no, um, there's no cross-contamination. There's no uh, even possibility of that as we move forward. So um, big things for, for this update is there's now uh, no limit to the classes that you can come to during the day. Uh, our Monday, Wednesday, Friday live classes here in the gym. Still going to be the same times. Want to see those things filled up all week long. Um, if we do a great job of doing that, we'll open up more classes uh, as we get going. Zoom classes are the same. Saturdays are back starting this week, 7.30, 9 o'clock class with a potential for the open gym as well in there. Um, one more thought on uh, Tuesday, Thursday. Um, I feel that the best thing for every athlete moving forward is a combination of high energy group classes on like a Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and then very individualized, very specific training on like Tuesday, Thursday. But it's also a great opportunity on Tuesday and Thursday to do an open gym style setting. So that's another option moving forward is having that open gym there. All right. Um, we will give you guys more details as that comes out as we start to like roll some of the smaller group stuff out. Um, it is going to be an, a wonderful experiment. And I think that we're going to start to develop. Uh, a, a much better, healthier, longevity lifestyle piece by by attacking it and doing it this way. So we're kind of happy with things, how things are going to be going. Uh, again, if you guys have any questions, please, please, please feel free to email me directly, uh, call me directly. I would rather you guys ask me questions so that I can address it to every single person uh, versus um, assuming things or just not knowing. That would be the the worst. All right. You guys have a fantastic weekend. We will see you back in the gym and back on Zoom. All right, bye.